Uh, what do you want to say to your fan? Okay, what's going on here? I don't really have any fans, but... So I'm going to teach you perpendicular distance. Teach me? I taught you that. I'm going to teach you guys perpendicular distance. You're calling me guys? You guys, you, you, you in the front. <laughs> oh, 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 you, <laughs> you. Okay, you're gonna teach what? What are you gonna do? So I'm gonna teach you. Chinese things, okay. Uh -huh, okay. Chinese. All right, do it fast though. You have five minutes. Five minutes, okay. So we're trying to find the distance between Z1, a point, mm -hmm. and a line. Right. In this instance, the point is Z1. And then, which is negative two comma three. Mm -hmm. Y, capital Y one. Mm -hmm. That that's that's the big line. What line? Which one? It's this line. See. Mm -hmm. It's capital Y one. Capital Y one is two x plus three. Okay. So how I'm gonna solve? You know how to put points on a graph. If not, this is y. Mm -hmm. So this is po this is the no. This is x. This is y. X axis, y axis. Positive numbers here. One, two, three, four, five, so on. Negative numbers here. Mama said to check the to taste the sauce. Well, okay, I'll be there in a few minutes. Huh? Huh? I'll be there in a few minutes. No, Baba, just that is good. You don't have to. That is good. Okay. Okay. So and the negative values yep. are. You're gonna come? These yeah, negative one, negative two, negative three, negative okay, four, and negative okay, five, so okay, on. Okay. Y axis positive, negative. Okay. You go to Y negative two. Okay, we get that. Okay. Okay. To graph, uh, and I used. Okay. <laughs> don't know what to say. So, for if the you don't line. Don't know what to say. Don't say it. <laughs> yeah, for the line, I graphed it using this logic. I replaced. X with zero, so two times zero. Okay, I'm just gonna go over two for because it's Bubba. X. See, two X. I'm gonna. Okay, so Did you put X. No. I put zero in, so X is now zero. So I it's zero. Mm -hmm. Now zero times two. You see zero times two mm -hmm. equals zero. Mm -hmm. So I stay here. It's obviously zero, zero, zero. Don't explain this thing. Keep going. So what's and three. Mm -hmm. So y is gonna be three. One, two, three. Here's my t one. Mm -hmm. I just call it t one. Are you explaining how you did that equation of y to yes, x? Okay. I am. So you plug in two x's x zero. Yeah, x and now one, and you find the y, and then you yeah. trace it down. Okay, all right. Yeah. So I plug now. I plug in with one. X is one. I go okay, on one. Y See, I, I did this dotted line, so I'm not confused, and you're not confused. Mm -hmm. So two times People one is two. People watching the videos are confused though. Yeah. Well, unless they are. Ninth graders, oh, high schoolers. Mm -hmm. So this is gonna. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Okay, so I did it. <laughs> I did t two. Mm -hmm. I replaced it. Two plus five. It, two plus three is five. So I went on y five. That's how I got the line. I drew the line. Blah blah blah. Mm -hmm. Okay, now what I have to do? I'm like. This is where the fun start, right? Yes, you see this line? You draw a line going through like that. Mm -hmm. Perpendicular. See, this is like kind of perpendicular. I did my best. Mm -hmm. Best. It's perpendicular. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I drew it through. Why you draw a line, line perpendicular to Z1? What's the point? <laughs> mm -hmm. A line perpendicular to Z1? Mm -hmm. Why? What are you trying to find out of this problem? All, out of all of this... I'm trying to find the distance between this point. Can you show us? Yeah. What, what's the, what, can you show us on the graph? Can you show me? The distance between Z1 mm -hmm. and... The equation, the first equation? Capital Y1. Mm, so you, you found the equation, you're trying to find the equation of the perpendicular line that goes from Z1 to that... Yeah. Line. Okay. So you draw a perpendicular... You that, how you found that equation? I'll explain it to you later. I'm just... So you, you draw go. this line, then where these two... Oh, where <laughs> y capital Y two and capital Y one intercept that's gonna be 
Z2, you see this Z2. little... Z2. 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 This looks like 22 with a line at yeah, this too. Z2. Z2. Uh -huh. I see that. Okay. Uh -huh. <sighs> and then you try to... And then you go on finding the Y. The Y, okay. So how did you find the Y2? Okay. It's base... This is the formula. Y... Okay, I'm j in this case, capital Y2 mm -hmm. equals A x plus b mm -hmm. so how you find the a you see the a in capital y one it's mm -hmm. the rise over run no it's down here yeah okay which is what the number of a okay two okay mm -hmm. it's the opposite like the opposite of two and the opposite operation It's the rise over run. Reciprocal. Reciprocal. Okay. So the opposite and the inverse. The rise over run. Okay. That's gonna be your A. That's a formula. That's everybody should know that. It's a formula, right? You did not come up. You did not come up with that. It's 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 known things. No, it's known. Okay. Sure. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So the A is how much the A? Oh yeah, I forgot to do it. You have. From Z2, mm -hmm. you have to replace the Y and 3. I'm sorry, I didn't mention that. You mm -hmm. have to replace the Y and the X. Mm -hmm. In this case, But Y we, is... We found the A. So what you're saying is we plugged in the A already, minus half, X, and then we're looking for the B, right? For the B, right? Yeah, we're looking for the B. In this case, it's 2 because I solved it. So to find the B, you have to plug in the Z1, which is belong to that equation anyway. Right? No. No? Yeah. Yeah. No, you don't plug in the Z1. You plug in the Z1's X and Y. Yeah, you plug in the Z1 by its own, by its, its X and Y. By its parameters. Parameters. Okay. And then okay. the B is how much? B is 2. So you found the B is 2. Yeah, because 1 half, in this case, times neg... Uh, We understand, so it's okay. easy to everybody can find out the B. So the Y2 is what? I'll just let you take a picture. And Screen the Y2 is what? Okay, the Y2 is two. negative mm -hmm. half X plus 2. What is that? Yeah. See that? It's negative right there. half That's X plus 2. Okay. And then? And then, mm -hmm. you, since... <laughs> <laughs> Hello, exhausted. <laughs> Yeah, you've been working like what 15 20 minutes on these things? <laughs> yes, yeah, so maybe 30 45 minutes. No, I don't think 45 minutes. Mm, okay. 25 30. Mm -hmm. So, you see, Y2 capital Y2 and capital Y1 are both equal because they're capital Y's. No, they're not equal because they're capital Y, they're equal in only one point of their intersection. The only equality of oh, these yeah, things is Z2. satisfied by Z2. Now, they're not so equal. You see, one is going like this, the other one is going yeah, like Yeah, that's why they and are equal. And then one is 2x plus 3, the other one. They are equal so in one condition. See, when they intersect, which yeah, is exactly Z2. Sorry, dirty So fingers. we can say confidently that at Z2, x, I mean, y2 and y1 are equal. Keep going. Yep, dirty fingers. Okay. This is very important. Yeah. Um, so, <laughs> I'm sorry. so you write. You don't have to do write this down. Just easy. So you write y one capital y one equals capital y two. So negative half. You work the x's together, huh? Yeah. You just write y one's e equation mm -hmm. equals y 2s equation. Yeah. So then you look for x. Here's mm -hmm. the vec. Here it is. It. After a long work, ah, the X is how much? And then they said, look, look, it's, you see this? How much And now I, I, you can see all this logic. I, I, I can't see, but nobody can see that. It's a gibberish. It's anyway, negative. X, negative, huh? Two over five, two fifth. Two fifth, which is what in decimal? Zero, negative <laughs> point four. Okay, and the Y? So how do you get the Y? How I got the Y is by plugging in... Plugging in negative two, oh, two fifth in one of the equations. I chose capital Y two. You don't have to choose it. Okay, either y I just or chose y. it because it's like easier. It has no yeah. fractions. No How much the y? How much the y? In yeah, the y, the y two of the z two. I mean, the y is eleven over five. Which is how much in decimal? Two point two. Okay, fantastic. Okay, so we got the z two. Calculations. 
calculation. We get the now distance. you can actually get distance. Distance. What's the, the distance, distance formula uh -huh. is. Please. C. And this is, I hope, the last things, right? That we're looking That's for. That's the last thing. And then you have to solve for that and then. Okay, go ahead. Root square of x2. I don't see d equal. D, oops, forgot the equal sign. Uh -huh. So d equals x2. In uh -huh. this case, it is z2's x. Uh -huh. How much are they? Z2 or x1. Uh -huh. No, x2 or x1. Uh -huh. It's because they're going to get squared anyway, so uh -huh. parentheses. Uh, mm -hmm. um, in this case, I'm gonna do <laughs> negative point four mm -hmm. minus and then minus negative two. So minus minus negative two. Well, wow. okay. So minus point four minus minus. Uh, a lot of minus. Maybe you should do plus that. The minus minus become plus, isn't it? Yes, they cancel out. Look, hey, I'm evil. Who are you? Like, and then this guy jives into it, so it becomes plus. That's my that's my dad's theory of why negative times negative is positive. What's my theory? Remind me? Make, huh? me. make me. Make me. Remind me. What's it's my like, theory? So like one negative uh, sign uh, goes trumping along, and then he finds an. A number and he's like, hey, what's that? What operation do you have? And he's like, I'm negative. Oh, oh, oh we're both evil. Let's let's join together and make good. Oh yeah, good idea. And then one dives in and he's like, and then a negative sign is like, hey, look, hey, jump on me. We're going to planet good. And then blah blah blah. And then oh, I remember that. Sorry. And then and the become negative. Plus, become and then the negative ball. jumps on him and he accidentally tips forward and he becomes a plus <laughs> because he dies in. Get yeah. See, no. look. Okay, I keep going. Then. Okay, you have one minute. Can Finish. I take a break? Yeah, take a break. Go ahead, take a break. Break, lover. <laughs> he has this rattlesnake. He always wants to play. Yes, you. All right, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Minus point four plus. plus two, uh -huh. So this cancels out, right? right? This cancels out, does it? What's cancel out? This. Why? Wait, no, no, that's... Oh, no, I, I'm sorry. Do you have square or no square? Yes, square uh -huh. Uh -huh. plus... Uh -huh. Y2 in this case, it... Y2 or Y1. I'm going to choose Y2. It's 2.2. Like my accent. 2.2. Dying. 2.2. Yeah. That's more. 2.2 uh, minus... 3. Or I want to actually change this. Thing. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Keep it like that. Thing again. Mm -hmm. D equals. So D equals. Mm -hmm. Now go four plus point four plus two equals. Plus one point six. I'm not sure about that. Yeah. No. C. Oh, that's two. I thought it's two point two. Okay. Yeah. No. 1.6 plus 2.2 but you have to two square, I, square here isn't it one point square isn't it squared oh yeah so uh -huh. 0. 0.6 squared equals 36 one squared is one so 1.36 what you're sure about that hmm. I'll, be, I'll be really impressed if it's true 1.6 times 1.6 is 1.6 times 1 and then 1.6 times 0.6 so 1.6 times 0.6. 1 times 6 point, yeah. Is, is 96, point 0.96 plus 1.6, which is 2.56. Okay, so 2.56. 2.56 plus, okay. Plus 2 minus 3 is 0.8. I can just change it. That's fine, no, no, keep it like that. So 0.64. Oh, Okay, 0 0.64. 0 0.8, 0 0.8, okay. And all that is square. So 2.56 plus 0 0.64, which is... We can completely ignore the 0, can we? Yeah, you can. Okay, so 0 0.64 equals... 2.56 plus 0 0.64, how much? 3.1? 3 3.2, right? Isn't it? Yeah, 3.2. Okay, 3.2, okay. So what the square, oh. square root of 3.2? 
No. no. The root square. I mean the square root of 3.2 should be less less than 3.2. Oh, I thought you said that square. But no, no, we're not. Uh, what's your D? The D is root square of 3.2, right? Yeah. So maybe less than 2. Oh, we forgot to root square this. No, you're going to root square the sum. The sum of everything. Okay. Which is 3.2. Put here 0 0.64, which is 0 0.8 square. 0. 0. 0.64. And this plus this is 3.2. So root square of 3.2 is... Uh, uh, can you do the, comp the in your computer 3.2 root square? You know what? Mm -hmm. uh, Around 1. Point, uh, I think 1.7. Let me see. Let uh, me check. Let me double check. 1.7 times 1 is 1, and then 7 is like 0, 0.7 or like maybe yeah, less than 2. Anyway, is the distance less than 2? Is between 1.5 and 2? Is it? Where's the distance? It's because I cannot use my my calculator. It will lose the video. Is that is that looks right? Between mm, one point five. That looks like one point, maybe two or three. Mm. Baba, what is it? Um, root square of three point two. Um, this. Um, yeah. yeah, this mm -hmm. root square. That. Yeah. yeah three point two. Three point two. Click the answer. It's my turn. Oh wait, first clear. I think I know how. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's three point two. Yeah. So like three point. I know. Two square. Root square. One point seven. That's eight, eight, nine. Eight. So one point. Seven nine. Eight, okay, eight, one point eight. Eight eight eight. Yeah. Okay. That's one point eight. So let's see that that distance is that one point eight. A little bit. No, that doesn't look. Like it, but. Okay. Uh, let me see here. 0 0.4 plus 2, which is 1.6. Do 1 point square, 1 six square uh, brain. Huh? 1.6 square. 1.6 square? Mm -hmm. Okay. How much is that? Let me check. Um, what was it? 1. Point six. One two six four. One point two six four. Two. One point. Two. One point six square. One. One point point six. No. Yeah. yeah no. One. One, 1. Six point six square is me... one point two six. So we made the mistake here. Something. We made the mistake. So here is not two point fifty six. Is one point two six? You said. One, two, six, four. And That's then this one. one. Point two, six, okay. And this one something. is. And this is zero point sixty four. So it's zero point nine. Do me. Do me the root square of. Hey, square root of one point nine. Zero. One point nine. Mm -hmm. Square root. Okay, one point nine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, one point nine. One point nine. Let me have my break. No, oh, it's good. 1.37a, one point, one point I'm going to round that to 1.38. Okay, so 1.38. So this one is 1.38, uh, Zachary. So it looks like it's far away more right. Yeah. Your distance is 1.3. If this is 1. 1.4. Approximately 1.4. Okay, so that is how. That's that is how you do it. Thank you. Oh.